The checkoff tool can be used to do a security assessment of your Terraform code, your infrastructure as code. As an example, I got a project here with lots of Terraform files inside all these different .tfs. And we can do an evaluation on all of them with the checkoff tool. The first thing, if you haven't installed it yet, you can do so just by following the instructions on the GitHub page for checkoff. It's under the Bridge Crew IO repository. And for Ubuntu and so forth, they talk about um, just using pip to do the installation here. And if you have a different operating system, there's other suggestions down below. Uh, but I'm using the latest version of Ubuntu based on Debian, and this pip command worked just fine for me. Another gotcha that's not mentioned in the documents is you may want to install test resources first. It's also from pip install, but the checkoff project um, seems to use this library and it complained when during the installation if I didn't have this installed first. I've already installed these, so if I hit these, it should should just say I've already got the latest. Um, but do the pip install test resources first, and then you can do the pip install checkoff after that, and it'll go through and make sure that you have the different packages that are dependencies, and then of course the actual project itself. So with that done, we can now run the checkoff command, and it does have some really good help, so you can list out the uh, different options if you want. But really, it, it runs just fine with um, without really having to specify any options if you're just interested in scanning a particular directory. So there is the, the dash D or dash dash directory option. All right, so we're gonna do dash D, and I, we're already in our Terraform directory, so I'm just gonna say current directory, which is the dot symbol. And it'll go through all the different files recursively and find the different issues on all the ones that it can. Whenever it finds a problem, it'll have this failed for resource, and it'll tell you which resource has the security issue, which file it's in, and give you a guide. Well, this pattern repeats. So if you just wanna see uh, kind of a condensed report, you can actually use grep to really quickly just get a, a filtered report that you can redirect out to a file if you want. So if we search for the word failed and we grab the two lines that are after it and the line that's before it just to create a space, then when we run the report, it'll it'll just pop out with these failed lines and the guide links for you. And then you can just send that out to a report of some kind really easily. So in this case, we'll just send the results to temp report. And then if we cap those results out, we'll see that it has those issues all listed inside. So a great tool, easy to use, works really quickly and that can definitely help you find those low-hanging security vulnerabilities that are in your Terraform project so you can get those cleaned up.